Hello, and welcome to these tutorial demonstrations on how you can get started using Group Link Everything Help Desk. My name is Catherine, and in these intro video tutorials, I will explain how you and your Help Desk team can increase productivity, improve communication, and efficiently report your successes using Everything Help Desk. In this video, I will walk through how a Help Desk ticket is recorded, how any staff member, such as a teacher, can submit a ticket through simply sending an email. Let's begin first with how a ticket is recorded. You have probably already requested your own access to the online sandbox trial environment of the software by visiting grouplink.com. Once you have received your instructions email with your sandbox access URL, it will take you to this page where you can choose between a technician login and an end user login. I will select the end user login for this example to understand the simplicity of the program. This automatically logged me into the application, landing on the main screen, the My Tickets view. I will begin by clicking New Ticket. A new window will appear and I can click the drop down arrow to select the group I'd like to submit a ticket to. If there is only one group, this will automatically select for me. The contact information fields will automatically be populated with whoever is logged in. I am currently logged in as a user named Thomas Jones. Keep in mind that the ticket content is completely customizable to fit your needs. The contact is grayed out in this demonstration, but that can be changed using the permission model. Under ticket info, I will go ahead and select the category of my issue, which is hardware, and under the category option, I will go ahead and select printer. Notice two additional fields appeared. We call these custom fields. These are fields that you can add to gain further information about the issue. The assignment has also filled in automatically. These can be auto-routed to technicians or can go directly to the ticket pool. Under the description section of your new ticket request, you will see that subject is also a required field. This section is built much like an email service. The subject is where I will write a clear summary of the nature of the ticket. There is also a CC and a BC field. If you need to notify someone at your organization of the ticket being entered, go ahead and enter the email address here. There is also a notes section that you can elaborate on the issue if needed. We also have the ability to upload an attachment if that is needed for the ticket submission as well. I am now ready to submit the ticket. This will return me to the main view of the My Tickets page. To view the ticket I just created, it will appear under the Owned by Me tab. This is how a ticket is manually created and organized within Group Link Everything Help Desk. Email to Ticket is the easiest way for users to submit a ticket using Everything Help Desk. You do that by sending a simple email. Anyone can submit a ticket and get updates and a resolution without ever logging into the system as a user. We call this email to ticket, meaning your staff can simply send an email to an email address of your choosing, which will then intelligently convert into an Everything Help Desk ticket. For example, I drafted this email addressed to the email address I created specifically for collecting tickets ithelpdesk at gmail.com with a subject summarizing the issue and in the body I gave more details. Let's see what this looks like as a ticket in the help desk once I press send. I send the email and we will find the new ticket in the IT request tab once we have logged in as a technician. The ticket will be found under the IT request tab. Once we open it, we will find exactly what we sent in the email here, and then as the technician, I will only need to add the details of the category and category option to save changes. Please note that this entire process can be customized to fit you and your business's needs. This functionality allows your staff to quickly and easily submit a ticket through their own familiar email client, making it ideal for employees, removing the need to learn a new system, and create tickets 
without their familiar system. We hope this brief walkthrough will help to get you started in everything Help Desk. There is so much you can do with this system. Watch our other tutorial videos for more features and tips. Thank you for using Group Link's Everything Help Desk.